hello and welcome to another episode of Robcraft with me, Damo. What was that? <laughs> what is that sound? Oh, I know. So, okay, the video for today is a tier 4 SMG uh, 666 <gasps> Lucifer uh, P flops. So, tier, what was it? Tier 4? Tier 4, are we? So, mirror mode X, there we go. Put on the mirror line. Don't forget that if you go into practice, the mirror mode will go away. It's very important that you don't forget that. So, SMG, huh? Having trouble winning those matches. Well, nail desperandum. I'm gonna give you some tips. So, survivability seems to be a big factor, in my opinion, nowadays, with... Uh... Do you know what? That is kind of narrow. Let's maybe go five. So, we now know the positioning. Let's get rid of that. So, uh, five, one, two, three four five we're immediately gonna do that because I'm gonna put on uh, ten wheels I know it feels excessive but I feel like having more wheels is better because uh, you you don't necessarily wanna just commit to something and die you might want to head back to your shield and deprive the enemy of destroying you and earning those extra clock cycles so the design will be ten wheels that's a given uh, I feel like with SMGs uh, I feel like with all bots, in fact, that having that survivability factor and the ability to get back to the shield is important. So we're going to do that. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to set the pilot seat kind of nearish to the back and I'm going to um, fully enclose it. It's a given. Definitely going to fully enclose the seat with at least that. Don't forget as well that you can get a prism in there. So let's bring it up off the ground. Uh, full stop and comma raises and lowers your bot. Uh, and also if you accidentally move it off center, the left and right arrows on your keyboard will, will move it back and forth. So let's go ahead and do that. And we're just gonna put some blocks up, blocks down. Just gonna try and solidify this, this bot a little bit because we do want it to have uh, quite a high level of survivability and a good way to in, in help ensure that is to have a lot of blocks. So, so yeah, I'm actually going to do that. I'm also right now going to do this because I do want to think about the cosmetic side of things. So I'm going to put prisms in there. I'm going to put a block in there. In fact, I'm going to do that as well. I'm going to just put that in entirely. I'm even going to go as far as far as to do this and start thinking about the design of the back as well. So let's go, let's go like that and like this. Shall we? Let's just go ahead and do that. And then put in these, because I do want it to look good as well, if I'm honest. 400, so we've got 260 left. We do need to start thinking about guns. Um, I do kind of want to do this. And if I can get away with it, I want two uh, forward-facing tier fours, which you can get away with there. Fantastic. Um, I then want to have two top-mounted tier fours. There looks like a good spot. We can go ahead and commit the rest of this to blocks. Um, can I get one there? You can get one there. It's debatable whether or not you want to put one there because that will be one of the first guns to go. Equally, this spot is really bad because um, it can potentially be one of the first guns to go. Uh, so what I'm going to do is uh, position a few blocks this way and have some guns down here. Now, you won't be able to shoot across, across the vehicle with those guns. However, having them so far back does increase the possibility of them surviving, being hit. Uh, six guns are the max amount of SMGs you have firing at what, any one time. So if you have more than six, it just increases the time in which you can have continuous rate of fire at the max, which is six. So we've got seven guns at the moment. We could go eight. In fact, we can go eight, but I'm not going to mount it there because I think that's a bit of a waste. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go uh, down to here. And I'm going to mount two guns there 609 what was it 666 okay so I can commit a lot more armor 
now. I'm not gonna go shields. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna use. Uh, I'm not gonna use shields on this build. Uh, I think there's a time and a place for shields, but this bot is not one of them. Uh, so let's just uh, try and spare a fort for the cosmetic side of things. That looks pretty good. These could go one in. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe if I can get away with doing this. Um. It's a bit of a dilemma because I'm thinking gun positions, but I'm also thinking cosmetically as well. And it's just, mm, should I go there and do that, or should that necessarily be something that I want to do? That. You know what? Let's just do that. Let's just uh, let's commit to this. Let's commit the rest of the P flops to armor. Uh, let's do that. Can I get away with this as well? I kind of want to build that section up as well. So, oh, we're getting close to the edge now. Now these guns, they don't need to be super connected. They can just have like token additions there. They don't need to be super attached. Um, they are designed like if they get knocked off, they get knocked off. It's no big, no big problem. Uh, I am gonna slim this down though, because I do want to spare a fort. Uh, also, with these fights, the lower down you are, the better off you'll be. Low profiles are always good. Uh, you can unfortunately get too carried away with it and make a profile that's so low uh, and poorly armored on the top that it makes it more susceptible to attacks by flyers. Uh, however, we should be okay uh, this time around. Let's do that. Um, yeah, we can get away with that. I think that's okay. Let's do this. What are we on? 664. It's kind of weak here. Okay, can't have that. Can't have that. So instead I'm going to go like this. And yeah, that is a little bit, uh, oh, 669, we've gone past the amount we can have. I'm unwilling to reduce there, so we need to take take it from somewhere else. And I think this might be the section that we, uh, that we take from. These back wheels don't necessarily need to be fully connected, so let's uh, maybe just think of what we want to do here. I do want to I do want to load on the extra armor there. It doesn't need to be doesn't need to be super pretty. Hmm 668 need to lose two. This is really vulgar. I just feel like that is really ugly. Just really ugly back here. Six, ah, six, six, one, six, six, five, um, six, six, six. There we have it. That will, that will do you. That will do you. Let's have a look. So again, ten wheels for the survivability. You could have gone for tier three wheels, which reduced. Is it still? Is this bot still tier four? You'd think, because I've stuck to the P-flops limit, and a person's struggling in tier four, so that should be okay. I might swap some out for glass, just. To, but you can, you know, you can swap it out for armor. Um, that's fine. So again, re weak in the back, but it's a real workhorse. It will get you through the tier. Uh, it's a reasonably low profile. The ten wheels give you survivability. The extra guns will do you in a like face-off. The two wheels at the front are steering because if you lose the front pair, you can still navigate. Yeah, that I do, yeah. I've just realised that I haven't had it in fancy graphics. Silly, I should have changed that. Could have had the tutorial in fancy graphics. Oh well, not to worry. So let's uh, let's just put in some glass blocks. 
Just because I wanna. You know, just because I wanna. No, I don't wanna do that. But I do wanna do this. Just there. And then, let's put in those. 668. Oh, come on, really? Well, we can move this back, I guess. 667. What are we on still? 667. Just need to reduce it by one. Let's just have that. There we have it. That's the bot. 666. Uh, SMG. That will that will take you through the fights. I'm sure we can take it for a test later on. In the meantime, I've been Table. Thanks so much for watching. That is a tier 4. Yeah, it's tier 4. Tier 4 SMG buggy. Real workhorse. Take care of yourself. Stay chum. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you've enjoyed what you've seen here today. Also, take care of yourself. And But most importantly of all, take care of yourself. <laughs> <laughs> but second most importantly of all, <laughs>